Hi. Hi. Okay, video number two. Where are we at? At 4537 Pack Saddle, corner of Pack Saddle and Arapahoe in the heart of Western Trails. Uh, and we're under contract. Under contract again. Thank you to Christy Bryant, our amazing realtor. Yeah. And um, for shooting these videos so that people can follow along. So there probably will be another video, but we're like 90% at this point. So there's a lot to see. Don't look at the outside. The outside. It's actually happening at the very end. Yeah. The inside, you won't even, if you watch the, if you watch the previous videos, you won't recognize the place. Unless you're the one-year-old like Jack, who would love me. Mention like what are all the things that you've done here because I noticed that a new recent model next door looks like they're having their sewer lines yeah. changed out. So these guys over here, moved, here. In, moved in fairly recently, uh, bought the house, uh, remodeled house, and they're having some work done on their sewer lines. Um, we didn't necessarily have to check the place the sewer lines, but there were some problems with the lines that we knew about, so we went ahead and replaced all the sewer lines so that the new owners don't have to worry about that kind of stuff. Because you're happy karma home. Yeah. Because we do things the right way. And it, it costs us money, but I also think you get it back when you sell it because people will pay for the peace of mind when they get one of our homes that we've bought through everything. We've yeah. done things the right way. All of our homes are fully permitted. Um, this home, new electric, uh, sorry, new uh, plumbing, new uh, HVAC system, new freshwater PEX plumbing in the walls. The windows, the interior doors, and then the new, new roof is coming, and then the outside. Yep, it'll have a new roof and paint, right? Oh, look, 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 guys. That is so cool. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. you seen that guy? Yeah, yeah he's we're in Western brown. Trails, by the way. Will not be brown. Um, so let me. Hi, Alice. When you used to walk into this house, you were like greeted immediately by uh, a wall, a door, and a, a wall here, and that was closet. We took all that out to open up the floor plan. We took out the wall between the dining room or formal living room and the kitchen. So when you walk in now, it's totally open, but also still has some separation. But also this front porch. Awesome so we vaulted, front porch. We took the we took the um, ceiling off of it and, and went with the vaulted. Yeah. And it's huge. It's really. Cool. I mean, look. <laughs> the porch used to be used to sit right on top of this brick ledge. So yeah. if you can imagine, it's amazing. I mean, just literally about the door, this was a porch. Uh, I love this so much. Yeah. yeah. Um, the floors are in. Yeah. Dun dun dun. Oh, I haven't seen the floors. Look at those. Those are gorgeous. Oh, the floors are gorgeous. Kind of hard to tell in this light. These are hardwood floors. We. Um, I shouldn't say we never would because the products are always evolving, but I love engineered hardwoods over a like a laminate or a vinyl plank. Um, I just love the feel of them. How are you, Esther? They're actually harder, harder uh, and more uh, durable. durable than most just regular hardwoods. Because so if I you know us in our product. personal life and you know our crazy ass dogs, uh, they oh. run. Oh. So, hi, Brandon. I'm sorry, Brandon. I'm sorry, Brandon. Um, want to go this way first? Yeah, I'm going to go this way first. They yeah. are really hard on the floors, so we choose products that our, our dogs could hold it. So, front, the front bedroom. This looks um, so good. And notice how much tidier this crew is. Yeah, this is, we have a great crew. This is a very different... This is, this, this it's is just great clean, room. it's just tidier. Yeah. It's nice. Yeah, that's true. Nice. Um, so this is the front bedroom. Um, let me take you over here over to... The other bedroom, it's, it's the same. This is a hall bath. We can put a pocket door in here. Uh, this door used to be a little bit over. We moved it. We put a pocket door in. We put a full. We put a full vanity. A uh, full closet no here. In here. So. One of my friends who's watching says she grew up on Burn Hill and Cherry Creek Drive, and some of her buddies lived on Pack Saddle. There you hey. go. That's awesome. So this, this is looks the second. So I, a little backstory on this house. This was a hoarder house. So mm, I, I was really excited about it because I like treasure hunting. I took my mom here to see it and I thought she would be so excited about the treasures and she ended up getting really emotional, crying and having to leave. So it's hard to see. It, it, it was hard. It was a, it was a, it took vision. Yeah. And it took a lot of work and I'm really proud of us and our crews to like yeah. have had the vision to stick with it and make this home like what it really could be. Yeah. Well, let's show the uh, mask. You don't go in there. So there's not room for all of this, okay. but so this is the hall bath. 
and some of the tiles already gone up in the around the tub, which is mm -hmm. cool. It looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. We're going white and black kind of motif in here. Really good. Kind of classic. We like to go with kind of a classic, timeless look. Um, so one of the things I want to show you. Let's come up, Anna. Come over here. So this is what I think this is is your formal dining room. Uh, there was a wall here between the kitchen and the dining room. Um, so we took that out. But what I wanted to say is we so that we left this wall here. Um, we left this wall right here to separate your dining room from your master bedroom, which we're about to go into. Um, but Brandon the floors here. look amazing, Brandon. Yeah, uh, Brandon had the really great idea. We have we, we so we kept another hallway here. You have these sort of two hallways running side by side. Brandon had a really great idea to close this off so you can add a second master closet, and it's. T totally changed the house now. I mean, um, I, I just got really teary. Like, that kitchen island. I, I, we're not there yet. <laughs> we're not there yet. Be patient. Oh, you. You're telling me to be patient. Be patient. He's never patient. They're, so, working. they're working on the floors. You yeah. just pop in yes. and kind of do a thing. This is your master bath or master bedroom. And there's two closets, oh, thanks to Brandon. Is it, is it time? No. I love the closet. Hey, Steve. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? I'm doing great. Okay, okay Anna, let's go look at your kitchen. Okay, okay, okay. okay. So, the this is mine. Come on. So. Oh, are we going to talk about the kitchen? I want to say something about my design. Derek designed it. Yes, that's true. And we, gonna we go went go. to go look for tile. And then we looked at the countertop, the quartz countertop. Oh my god, you guys, this is my first time to see this. It looks that. fabulous. Hey, Guess what? This, this, this is insane. Do you mean this nine or this ten foot? I did not know it was going to look like this. Island? This is wow. Wow. You guys, this is like, you can go. You can do your fine. You're good. This is amazing, Steve. Oh, thank you very much. It's all brand new. Oh, oh my god, it's gorgeous, you guys. Oh my god. It's gorgeous. Hester, you guys are killing it. <laughs> so the other thing I'll tell you. Know, wait, no, what I was going to say is, so we're tile shopping. We're so excited. And we're like, yeah, this is great. And then I'm like, well, where's the sample of the of the countertop? Because I hadn't, I wasn't part of that deal. And Derek shows it to me. And we both look at each other and we hate it. And you can see it's really big. So, so we changed it. We changed That's it. The bottom and it took weeks. And a lot more money, and then we ended up doing a waterfall. No. We also hadn't planned on doing that because we make houses that we want to live in. I mean, this house is this is insane. I, I can't. I can't. This is like it's I, amazing. I, I said it on our it's social so media. Good. A happy karma home on our Instagram that I'm a sucker for waterfall. <laughs> I, this I, is amazing, I, guys. I'm gonna come to the site. And, and also, we did it at Pex, at and also, oh yeah, that's true. That's frontier. Just, this is just, <laughs> this is just a white. I think it's called Arctic it's white. white. Arctic white. Arctic white. Yeah. There's a little there's a, tiny bit of a shimmer to it, but I, I love it. It's, this whole space is completely different than the last time I was here. We're gonna do a dark um, navy backsplash. She wants a little bit of color. Yeah. So we're gonna do that. The other fun <laughs> thing is that. If you, if you find one of our houses before we've done some of the work, um, you know, we've been, we're really easy to work with. And when we've, you know, had some questions and she's been able to get a few things like custom for the yeah, 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 we so, add a couple things in. Yeah. I mean, I have to be careful about that because like we can't do it on everything, but on the things that we can do, like we made sure we hated the countertop. We were like, maybe she would like the countertop. No, nope, she also hated the countertop. So, you know, Pretty much if, really, we, if we hated it, it's yeah. terrible. But it's been really fun because it's nice to work with a client to make it even more custom, right? Um, what is okay, this? garage. I want to talk. I, I just want to show them the oh, utility yeah. room. I love the utility room. This used to be a part of the garage. Yeah. I love it. It's huge. Yeah, yeah. It's huge. Well, like, here's an example. We were going to carry the hardwoods through, the, through, and she really wants tile. So she's getting tile. She's getting, she's getting tile. Like that's great. Oh, this this is what you were talking about. I never did understand that. Yeah, this is a full height pantry. Yeah. So because we don't have a ton of cabinet space here, I wanted to make sure that we, that we have a full height. There's pantry There's so much here. storage. I know. There's so much storage in there. Yeah. So much storage. But for your like zero yeah, boxes. Oh my that's god, also, you guys, this house is amazing. That's also why we don't do stupid floating shelves. 
Because most people don't have stuff that looks that good and they're not organized like an interior designer on Instagram. So we have cabinets because otherwise you won't have enough shelves. Okay. One more thing I wanted to Derek say. Derek says I'm not allowed to talk. And this, <laughs> this is a testament to <laughs> this is a testament to, my, to these guys here. Mm -hmm. This, this is like a level five finish. I don't know if you can see. Yes. The on the ceiling. The ceiling. You guys. And we're gonna. It's actually a little too shiny, so we're gonna go back and repaint the ceiling uh, yeah. with the flat because it's too shiny. But this is like this is an insane finish on the sheetrock, which is very, very hard, time-consuming, and expensive to do. These guys did a great job. I'm really proud of how this came out. This was a carpet. And it now, is now a garage. garage with a door, and it, I think we even have an electrical plug-in, right? It's going in right going here in? for an electric vehicle charger. For an electrical vehicle. I mean, this is insane. Oh, a transom window. So we've said this on previous videos. But maybe you're going this for the first time. You know, this to add a to add a. Let's to let's let's, let's go. Let's go talk. I can't see y'all very well, okay. so let's go stand so, outside. Yeah, so convert this to the the um, These generator. Are outside, over there. This is the generator. Yeah. So anyway, all I can say is it took something to turn this into a garage. But we really felt uh, like okay. This house needed a garage. I'm gonna jump in real quick. It took a lot more than something. We had like nightly panic attacks. <laughs> it took so <laughs> much time, yeah, so different. much money, so much emotional doubt, wondering because everybody said not to do it. Again, just like Frontier, they said not to add another bedroom and bathroom, and we did anyway. And everybody was like, no, don't do a garage. You don't have to do it. And again, we make houses that we want to live in. And I want the fucking garage to hide all of our junk. <laughs> Okay, so who are y'all if they're interested in the next home project from you? How are they going to find you? So, Happy Karma Homes. Yeah, you can find us on Instagram, Instagram. or our website, Happy Karma Homes. But we never update it. Yeah, One day we're going to get an assistant. Derek, Derek and Anna. Yeah. And if you need a realtor, who are you going to call? Chrissy, Chrissy Bryant. Bryant. Best Woo! Yes. <laughs> and um, our next project is coming to you soon in Temple, Texas. So if you're like, oh, I'd really like to live in a smaller town, but I love the Austin area, you can have all of that for like a third of the price. Half, maybe. Yeah, half of the price, yeah. yeah. Um, in the historic district of Temple that's walking distance to downtown. So that's coming next. Thanks, guys. Bye.